You're still full of shit. A lot more people here than I thought. Are they musicians too? Talia collects dreamers dumb enough to pick fights with Anton's Ministry of Culture. I just make sure they aim the barrel away from the face. Thought I was the only dropout. Papa was a drill instructor. Family's fifth gen army until me. What happened? Expelled. When Papa found out I turned from his favorite daughter into a freak. His words. Shit. Just trans in the military, compai. I was lucky. Talia caught me trying to steal her gear, but instead of turning me in, she gave me a deck. Liberta can help all of you here. Liberta? When Castillo won, we left riots with Clara. And what did he get us? Clara runs off to play guerrilla, Talia gets thrown into Maria Marquesa's bullshit academy, and I have to take a big fucking debt to get her out. From who? Bembe, black market smuggler. Once he's paid off, Talia and I are off this fucking rock. Let me take some debt, Paolo. I don't do handouts. Okay. Why'd you leave the military? Punch my drill instructor in the throat. I'm not a morning person. Segunda. Bembe deals in the church. You Bembe? I know a sinner when I see one. What's wrong with Ola, asshole? Try to fuck me, Danny Rojas. I sell your organs to the Yankees. And I know if I shoot you, Palo's death disappears. No. You have rules. You might kill, but you're no killer. Mierda. You got me. So what does that make you? I kill guerrillas. I also kill soldiers. It's just business. Easy to pretend you're not picking sides. My father was a guerrilla in 67. After the revolution, he put on a crisp military uniform. Thirty years later, to his surprise, a fresh new revolution with fresh new guerrillas. They thank him with a bullet to the skull. Buried in the same crisp uniform. Are you ready for your uniform, Rojas? Goes both ways. How's that? You were just dressed like a priest. <laughs> I like you, Danny Rojas. We can do business. Fucking Bende. Would be fun. Every one of you. <laughs> Shit, a fumigator. <laughs> go, Luso, go.
some soldiers at the hotel. Might be. Hey, I'm just trying to help you. You don't help people, Bembe. You use them. I'll take that as a thank you. What do you <sighs> want? Are you Dimitri or Vasily? Dimitri, who the fuck are you? Bembe sent me. Where's the key? <laughs> so that's what this is about. Bembe fucked us good. First he sends military, then he sends you. I don't work for Bembe. I'm just here for the key. My brother has the key. The soldiers drowned him like a dog, but he didn't once beg for his life. He died in that fancy pool like a man. My Vasily. Gracias. I'm sorry about your brother. I'm getting out of here. You should too before Bembe stabs you in the back. Idiota to stop! I never should have come to this godforsaken country! Bembe! You fucking hijo de puta! Ah, so you got my key. See, si, I found it on your dead Russian friend. What's in that book? For you? Paolo's freedom. The hotel. And what a surprise. The army is here. I'm at the hotel. And so is the army. But I think you are ready. Save me your bullshit. Let me guess. You want me to take them out? <laughs> you see? This is why I like you, Rojas. Don't kill the soldiers from me. Find the target. this for a book. Now to clear the area of soldados. Bembe, it's done. I got your book. Muy bien, Rojas. I can 
see why Clara has so much faith in you. You are such a good little gopher. <laughs> Is that what you think I am? Prove me wrong. I don't have to prove anything to you. Tell me where to meet you. I'm across the north bridge of the hotel. All this for a book. ¿Qué tal, Rojas? Thank you for securing my new port. Thought you wanted the book from the safe. Can the man have both? Of course, Via Hudia Hotel is the real prize jewel. It's the best smuggling port on the south coast. You just needed someone to clear out the competition. The Russians make good money from this place. And with this book of corrupt officials in their pay, that money will now flow to me. We are done here. But you and I still have business to do, Rojas. You've paid off some of Paolo's debt. But not all. Don't worry. I have more work for you. I haven't seen you before. Yo! So you know, I'm a badass radio DJ. Okay, that's a lie. But you inspired me, Danny, with your guerrilla-ness. I dream of my sexy voice, Maximus Matanza's music, and Libertad's message all over the airwaves. I call it Radio Libertad. I dream of you spraying a logo all over Maria Marquesa's shitty propaganda. Here's spray paint and some bombs I made to make handing out flyers go way faster, okay? Counter propaganda right into the machine. <laughs> yes! Oh, I can't... Oye, bicho, más segunda. About fucking time. You're slower than my shits after I eat too many platanos. I swear to God, bicho. What you waiting for? Spray the posters, plant the bombs, get the fucking word out. Radio Libertad is waiting to be born. Corre, chop, chop. Career. Fuck you, Castillo. Bicho, going pretty good so far. Nice logo. Gracias. Just keep those edges clean, okay? I got it, Bicho. Like, keep your wrist loose, okay? Smooth strokes. I got it. Cojone. Love you. Keeping those wrists loose. Yeah. 
Okay. I'm good. One more. <laughs> Check that one out. Bicho, all done. That was fun. Yes, way! Oh, man! We're gonna make a radio station, Danny! We're gonna be the voice of La Revolucion! Well, you are, Senor DJ. Right! And what a voice it is! Good spot for Bicho's flyer bombs. Planting explosives in a public area. What could go wrong? Why? You don't think the government has the right to put them up? Well, they oh, yeah, whoa! Don't touch that! Submit to Castillo! Oh. Just throwing out some trash. Nothing to see here. away. Bicho, I'm done. No, 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 man. You're not done. Are you ready for the next step? I'm ready. Okay, so Maria's on her way. There's a banner she's gonna unveil. Oh, I am, am I? It's high up, but you can get there, right? You, you think Clara's gonna like it? Yeah, go team! I'm into it. Go team! of you. Bicho, I can now add vandalism to my list of capital offenses. <laughs> More like the list of shit that makes you a fucking badass! Come meet me at the gas station outside town. Kurele! Hello, my beautiful foreign friends. Any questions before we begin? 
Minister Marquesa, are you concerned that... How do you respond to rumors that Diego Castillo is your son? I don't. Diego Castillo is the first son of Yara, and an example to all true Yaras. Now, it is my pleasure to unveil the construction of the Anton Castillo True Yaren Cultural Center. Immediately. You see? This is the kind of cultural pollution we are fighting against. Ah, uh, we just need to borrow your phones and your cameras. <laughs> Everyone in Yara saw that shit! Oh my god, Danny! We have so much to do! I'm blowing my own fucking mind! <laughs>